Two months ago, I took a train in Tanzania and it turned out to be the worst night of my life. I swore to myself I would never get on a train ever again in Africa. Well, that turned out to be a lie. Welcome to the Ethiopian night train. Let's do this. Okay, so here we are on the outskirts of Addis. It's 8 p.m. in the evening, and this is the train station. Look at that. Looks like an old British colony building, doesn't it? But obviously it wasn't a British colony. The Italians tried to colonize it, and they failed miserably. So yeah, let's get on the train. Okay, we got into the train station. Bad news, the people I'm with, which are these people right here, this is Ned Yats. Ned Yats? Is this your first time on a train? First time on a night train for her, and then these two rookies. Johan and Salam, which you've seen in other videos. Basically, me and Salam have a sleeper bed, but the other two don't, so they're going to be sat in a chair the whole night. So we're going to have to rotate, you know, share the bed. So already, it looks like it's going to be a rough night. But who knows? Let's check out the train, see what it's like, and then, yeah, see how it goes. Okay, here we go. I tell you what, this train is smart. It's decent. Look at this. Look at that. Everyone's got their uniforms on. Let's do this. Hello. Hey. Thank you. Let me show you a Oh. Oh, this is all right. This is it? This is decent. We're up here. We're quite high up, though. This is better than the Indian trains. I can tell you that right now. And the entire train stinks. Okay, here we go. Top bunk. How much should I pay for this? Um, hundred pounds. Hundred pounds? Yeah. It's about twenty dollars. I think that I'm. I think I'm his secretary. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay, up you come, Salam. <laughs> Top bunk. <laughs> Welcome to the Ethiopian night train. Wow, this is nice. It's alright, isn't it? Bit cosy. So there we go. This is my uh, bed for the next 12 hours, I think. I'm going to the east of Ethiopia to a place called Harar. Um, things to point out. There's a foreign price for this train ticket. Mine costs like $20 and the local price is like $10. You know, whatever. Um, is that fair? I don't know, probably not, but whatever. And yeah, Salam, what do you think? Rain out of 10 so far? 400 bird, what a bargain. <laughs> yeah, for me it was like 900 bird. Um, yeah, so 12 hours, so far so good. But let's see how it goes, eh? Come on. So I just quickly ran over to see where Johannes and Nebby had work. The security guards were like, where are you going? You can't leave the carriage. So um, yeah, I have to literally stay put in this carriage. You can't leave it, obviously, unless it stops or something. But we're setting off in like 30 seconds. So looks like I'm here for the night. So me and Salam are going to chill out. I think I'm going to watch a film. Got one download on Netflix. But yeah, um, I'll keep you updated if it gets bumpy, if it gets crazy. But so far, I'm happy. Okay, it's time to examine the toilets. I'm guessing it's going to be a hole in the ground, but let's find out. But first things first, this is a decent train. Look at this. Nice and clean. Spacious, sort of. Yeah, not bad, eh? So uh, let's see what the toilets are like. So apparently that is the toilet. And apparently they don't leave, sorry, they don't open until the train leaves. No idea why, then they automatically unlock. Yeah, <laughs> no idea why. So yeah, back to the bed I go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so basically, um, 
the reason we haven't left yet, I just spoke to the lady, is because it's raining. Um, yeah, we haven't left yet because of the rain. So I don't think the train's waterproof, apparently. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me just back up. Well, about bloody time. After about two hours of waiting, we have finally left the station. So it's time to relax, get some sleep, and hopefully it's a good ride. All right, good night. Oh, I nearly forgot. Now the train's moving, I can finally go to the toilet. Judging by the cleanliness of the train, I'm expecting a good, clean Western toilet. Let's investigate. <laughs> So far, so good. Not bumpy, it's nice and smooth. I wish I'd turn that light off behind me. Look at that. Jesus, I can't, even, I can't sleep with that next to my head. Oh, God. slept all right to be honest. I'm now going to show you what third class looks like where my other two friends spent the night. Just walking through it, I imagine spending 12 hours here. Let me show you. So this is what it's like in third class. These two poor guys have sat here for 12 hours. 12 hours. How was your night? It's absolutely awful. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely awful. Yeah. I, I can't believe it. How was your night? It, man. Feel so That's sorry fun. for you guys. Yeah, my face can't take the story. <laughs> it's a shame, really. I only had about, what, nine hours sleep? So I usually get about 12. Big <laughs> move, Oh dear, guys. I've had maybe like. <laughs> Hour? A couple of hours. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, after around 13 hours, we've arrived in the city of Deer Dawa. So, yeah, crucial tip if you get the night train in Addis, get a bed. These poor guys. <laughs> oh. And the thing is, they wouldn't let us swap because we were going to swap. Once you're in that compartment, you can't leave until the next morning. So, get a bed, get a bed. This is the benefit of bringing locals with you, they can get you hitchhiking to the city. Come on, boys and girls. Feeling better now? <laughs> okay, now we're in a proper taxi. Where are we going, do you know? So we're not in Deirdua. So we are in Deirdua. Get some food and then get a taxi to Ra. It's like an hour's drive. Jesus. Hey, salam. Salam. Salam, no. Hey. This is it. How much? How much? 35. 35. Is that right? That's good. That's good price. Okay, we're now in the 
preferred mode of transport. That dude that just dropped us in a van was free, completely free. And now we're heading to Hurrah in his minivan. It is like a thousand degrees in this car. How you doing guys? Thanks to these guys, it was 35 bar. 35 bar. No chance they would have charged me that. So yeah, one hour to Hurrah. Let's go. Not much leg room for the next hour, but it's better than a guy in front, he's sat on a tin cam. <laughs> Good lord. This is a reminder not to get the seated train ticket and to get a bed. Poor guy is knackered. After only 24 hours of travel, we've arrived at the final destination in Hurrah. I am knackered. So I'm going to be filming the city tomorrow. I'm going to film the hotel in a second. Let me just get there. And then, yeah, the real journey starts tomorrow. So, yeah, welcome to Hurrah. Look at these streets, narrow cobble streets. So it's not all like this, these like cobble streets. We just walked through this like crazy city, it was manic. Um, but you'll see that in the next video. Oh, we're here. Look at these, look. What a cool place. Yo. Here we are. Yeah, looks very safe. Got barbed wire up here. Perfect. This is nice, isn't it? What a place. Look at this. Unreal. Whoa. That is incredible. This is what I've seen online on the photos. This is decent. I'll come back to this in a minute. Let's check upstairs. So this is the upstairs. Look at this. Choice of rooms. This is where Salam and Johannes are sleeping. And then another room here. Ideal. All right, let's check out my room downstairs. So this is the downstairs. This is where Nebiat's gonna be sleeping tonight. Not bad, huh? Nice cozy little room. And then you go straight into mine. It's quite dark. I don't think there's a light in here. I don't know if you can see that, but there's my bed for the next two nights. So uh, yeah, let's um, unpack and take it easy. I've got something pretty incredible planned later, but, and I'll tell you what it is in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, after 27 long hours, we've arrived in our final destination in Harar. We are all dead. Oh my god, man. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to chill out. This is where I'm going to end the video. The next thing I've got planned is pretty crazy. It involves a hyena. So, stand by. <laughs> 